All right, guys, I got five minutes until my next patient here, so I'm going to go ahead and record this video for you really quick. What I'm going to do is we're going to run through how I do these. These are phenomenal, these little bonded retainers. Um, you're, going to, you're going to love these things because they're the easiest thing in the world to 3D print, and you could design them in under a minute. So here's what you do. You go to your select tool in Mesh Mixer. By the way, Mesh Mixer is a free software you could download from the internet. Put your... Um, size to where it's nice and small and come in here and create a lingual bar okay what I'm also going to do is I'm going to create some retention elements here on the cuspids a little bit right there a little bit right there I sometimes will create little retention elements like so hit B on the keyboard B is in boy to smooth that Hit Y as in yellow to make that its own file. What you're going to do is hit Control A to select the whole thing. You're going to hit D as in dog. That's going to go ahead and extrude that surface. 0.8 millimeters is kind of what uh, usually what I go for. Um, this is personal preference. I've gone thinner than that for sure. You're going to hit accept. Okay, then what I do is I hit select, I um, select this surface, like this, but not the intaglio fitting surface, and I go to deform smooth. That will smooth that whole entire surface without altering the fitting surface. And that is it, then I will right click, uh, let me see, clear selection, that is my final bar. Let me show you how that fits onto the uh, model. So I'm loading that model back in, so that's what we get. And it looks really thick and bulky here, but it is paper thin. Um, these things are super comfortable for the patient. They're smooth, um, better than a titanium wire in my opinion. Um, so I will just go ahead and click that and go to File, Export, and save that STL as a binary STL and 3D print that sucker. So I hope this helps. Super easy to do these guys.